I'm going to quickly walk through some of the NetLogo interface. I'm using the online NetLogo interface guide as a reference. So upon opening NetLogo, you see three different tabs, Interface, Info, and Code. Interface is where you would put your buttons that control the operation of your program. Info is used to document your model. It's important to do this so other people, when they look at your model and want to find out what it is for, what it includes, what assumptions are made in the model, they would find that information here. And finally, the code tab. Now this used to be called the procedures tab and it is where your program lives. So code, info, and interface. Let's open an existing model. So I'll go to File, Models Library, and I'll look at the ENTS model again. We can see what's in the interface. We have a Setup button and a Go button, and these can be created using Add. That's how you add a button. And they also can be inspected, so if you hit control and click on a button. You can say edit and you can find out more about the button. This button is an observer button and it calls the command setup. The info window tells you a little bit about this model, how it works, how to use it, some things to notice, and some ways to expand the model. In the code window, you'll see you have different declarations, patch variables, and then you have procedures. And you'll notice, for instance, here is the setup procedure. Now this is the procedure that's called when someone clicks on the setup button that we saw in the interface window. Let's go back and take a look. Okay, so it's calling the command setup. And again, that's here. You can also access other procedures simply by clicking on procedures and picking one of the procedures to investigate. Okay, that's it for now.